morning this is our room and the state of our room this morning it's just disgusting so messy now we have to pack this all up again oh my god but it's not raining at the moment so fingers crossed So we live in the hotel and it's raining again. How crazy is that? Living back door. The man at the reception told us that we are mad. I am mad. But I strongly believe that the weather will improve today. I really do. Although it is raining. Anyway, we're taking the low route, so it's change of plans all the time. Unlucky second day in rain. <laughs> Leaving the village, going to forest. So we're going towards the golf club to start with, and it's blowing. So the house with a massive chimney, the thunder. It's still got a rain drop left on its screen. I'll probably put a name of it down below. At least I can remember all of them places. Well, it's still ringing, but it will be till afternoon. What can you do? What can you do? So we're entering the forest and there are fallen trees here and a lot of shadows so we're gonna have to take it slow and be careful again but yeah it should be a little bit easier than yesterday um choosing this uh, low road instead of mountain road just for today so it's all good try not to get too wet and we'll be fine we just met this uh, guy a couple of minutes ago, 90 years old. Absolutely crazy condition, I mean, I never said he was 90. And we had a little chat with him. He was telling us about the roots, the trees they have been cut recently. And all this mess, he wasn't happy about the mess, and apparently the mess will, will be cleaned. So he wasn't very happy about that. Really nice man. And yeah, he was good to have a chat. Now this 
is the wrong way. We actually have to take the path over there uh, into the forest. So we're coming down again and heading into the forest. Me and I'm wet again. It's hard, I have to tell you, it's very hard to be so wet all the time. Check that out, we sort of leaving this uh, forest now and these views uh, are opening now amazing view even in a rain even in a fog even if even in this dual weather it's beautiful so pretty we are looking for a place for a break and I think I found it on those steps stones there it's a good place to sit down not on the floor right next to this stream which is so pretty Hey, and it's kind of stopped raining for now, <laughs> so I think that's good. Apple I took from the hotel. Mm. It tastes so good. It's crazy to think that someone was actually living here. Look at those windows on the roof.
Okay, so we're now entering the forest called the Brennin. And I would say this is probably uh, one fourth of our way for today. Very pretty. And this is us, this is where we're going. Look guys, the highest peak of this forest, 435 meters, uh, it's a volcano or extent of the volcano and there is gold in the hills and copper at the bottom of the forest. That is amazing. Okay, there's a route. I have to take my boys in here, definitely.
cheese and potato. <laughs> and parsley sauce. Yummy? Yummy, yummy. Hello! Oh, and you've got a baby there! That is so cute! The baby there! Who's the mama? Who's the mama? Are you the mama? Are you the mama? How are you? Hello, you! Hey! Is your baby lying down like this? We need water. Which one is the real boss? Are you the boss? Look, the girls are going. The girls are the bosses. Girl power. Tonight, this is amazing because we're actually gonna stay on this camping site that we accidentally found and we can have a little fire going and it's gonna be just good. We don't have to hide tonight and yeah, I love it. It's good. So end of the second day and we were walking the uh, low route today from the Getlo and we got here to uh, Lynn Traus, I believe it's called and luckily we found this place this farm a uh, camping farm and so we've got a fire going and we've got a toilet and a shower with hot water for morning we're gonna attend so there already now we're gonna have a food today it wasn't too bad it was raining to start with but till about three o'clock and then it stopped and it was sunny and we had um, uh, enough time to actually dry and all our gear and clothes are dry so we don't have to worry about that everything will be very good for tomorrow and we really need the rest we did how many kilometers today 25 about 25 kilometers and yeah happy days it's a it's a good day good day and good night see you then <laughs> 